Hey guys, what's good? So today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how I transfer my Hi8 video to my computer, specifically on OBS with a Mac. And what you need is this video transfer cable, which you can buy on Amazon for about eight to $15. And what you need is a audio output cable. This one came with my camera, but you can also buy on Amazon for about, I wanna say eight to $15 as well. And once you have that connected together, take the audio output cable and insert it in your camera. And you can find this on your camera uh, with the yellow port. I'm not sure if other Hi8 videos do have a yellow outline for their port, but it's just easily seen on my camera. So connect it there. Take the USB transfer cable and connect it to your USB port. For me, I have a modern Mac and I need a USB-C hub to connect the video transfer cable and once you have that connected take it to your macbook and connect it and you'll see it right there that it's powered on then what you want to do is take your hi8 tape and insert it into your hi8 camera and once you have that in there go ahead and switch the playback button and then you can press play i already have it set up on my software or it's already connected so I'm gonna show you guys how I you know put together the settings and how I export it and this is my method other people have different ways of doing it but this is mine now that we have OBS open I'm gonna show you guys my settings so you can put this video on the side and copy what I have side by side or you can actually press pause and copy the things that I have on the screen now to let you guys know, all the videos that I have on my YouTube channel on Hi8 use the same exact settings. And a lot of these settings are actually at default. All the values here are at default. But if you need to make any changes, go ahead and do that. Most of the time I don't need the audio uh, for my videos. So I just leave that alone. Uh, I just place music over my videos. Uh, specifically for the work that I do. Now that we have our settings, let's go ahead and create a scene, which you can find on the bottom left corner of OBS. A scene is basically where you're getting your source from. So for this one, I'm getting it from my Hi8 camera. And what I'm gonna do is click the plus sign under sources and connect both audio and video and connect it to the correct device, which is the USB transfer cable. For this one, it's AV to USB 2.0. Yours could be a different name. It might depend on how it's being read through your computer, but for mine, it's audio video to USB 2.0. Once you have that connected, I need to resize the video. And for this specific tutorial, I do like my letterboxing along with my Hi8 format. Uh, some people will just want the full crop that's fine but for me i prefer it this way so i have it set up in the middle and once i have that set up i can start recording my video and make sure you know where you're recording your video and if you don't know where it is go back to the settings and choose the output folder once you're done recording all the footage from your hi8 tape from your camera go ahead and press stop recording and find your video in your output folder. And that's pretty much it. To summarize everything, pretty much copy the settings that I have on OBS. Again, a lot of it is at default. Some of it has been changed. So if you see a different value, go ahead and copy that. If you like the way I export my videos. And I'm gonna show you guys some quick tips for those who do similar work as I do, or if you just want to get creative with your footage. So one thing that I do to make my footage interesting is that you can also press rewind while you're recording on OBS. You can also press pause and it'll just give you like these cool effects that you don't have to do in posts. And that's something that you guys can try and add to your own videos. And that's all folks. I uh, appreciate you guys for watching. I hope this helps anyone out there who's looking to transfer their videos on Hi8.